How's it going, everybody? Welcome back to another video. Um, <clears throat> and today I have a haul. Um, as you may have noticed, I have not been uploading the past, I think, four days, even though I have videos on my phone that I still have yet to upload. Uh, that being the 90s subscriber special, which I hope will be up before this, but anyway, I was on vacation in Long Beach, New Jersey. If you guys have ever been there, go there. If you want to rent a house for $2,000 a week. Anyway, but, um, yeah, there's, um, I didn't find some cars there. No Monster Jam trucks, unfortunately. Um, but yeah, I'm so happy that I found some stuff. So, let me start with that. <clears throat> so, the first day we were there, my dad ran to CVS. And he told me they had a Hot Wheels section. And he picked me up. Sesto Elemento. already have it, but if my dad or my parents pick me up a mainline, I already have. Keep a card for the heck of it. Might be worth something in the future. But, I asked him if there was a bad dagger there. Or, there was a motorcycle there, because I noticed this was from the K-Case assortment. And he asked, what the heck did it look like? So I showed him a picture on TwiCollector24's Instagram. And he said that they have it. So the next day I ran there, picked up the bad da uh, bad dagger. Whatever. Anyway, um, I also went to like this gift shop. Um, they did have a Matchbox, $2.69. And there was a car that I wanted. but. And today, when we came home... Um, it was Monday, it was probably uploaded on Tuesday, but we did run, they did have this toy store in the neighborhood, and my dad asked if we wanted to go to it. They did not have any Hot Wheels, but they did have, I think, a 2013 stock of Matchbox. Let me take a look. Uh, next, I think that's 2013, based on the packaging, but they had an old Matchbox assortment, and, um, if you guys were in Matchbox collectors back then, they used to have amazing licensed models. Now they're just kind of going like Hot Wheels style. Well, that's actually what it was from like 2012 to 2015. This year, they're really stepping up their game, coming out with a lot of licensed models, bringing back some older ones. Anyway, did find two Matchbox models at the shop. Um, nothing too special. Um, first one I got was a 1960, 1969, um... Chevy Camaro, nice color. Um, my dad likes cl classic cars, so he liked this. So I picked that up, not bad. Um, second car, I was really happy to find this. I saw this on Instagram and I really wanted it, but I realized it was 2013. Now I have it. It's a, um, a Suzu Amigo. Really nice car, nice and basic. Um, not too decally, as um, when, when Matchbox does come out with a license model, they tend to put a lot of decals on it. And, I don't like that, but... And they also had Johnny Lightnings there, which I have not seen since I was, like, eight. Um, but they are coming back this year, I know that for sure. But they did have an old stock of them, which is really cool. Um, Johnny Lightning 2.0. And this is the series that have, uh, rubber tires. Actually, wait, they all have rubber tires, my bad. Anyway, um, my dad wanted me to get this because it was my actually my mom's first car. Except in, like, a different, like, brownish color. But, 1981 Chevy Citation 80s car, so. Never even heard of this car. It's a really nice looking car. Um, I am going to unbox the Matchboxes and the Johnny Lightning. So, let's start off with the Suzu Amigo. They have, like, the Monster Jam. Like, you have the tab here that you press your thumb on. And, you just release it like that. Oh, crap. I forgot to take an Instagram photo. Uh, okay, um, not gonna unbox these on this video, sorry about that, um, actually, wait, let's see if I can try and do this, okay, let's see if I can do this, hopefully that, hopefully you guys can, god, here, you guys see it, hold on. Trying to face the camera so I can get a picture of the cars. There, good enough. Hold on. Oh, okay. <laughs> Sorry about that, guys, but... Okay, now that I have an Instagram photo, let's open them. Whoa, that opened easy. Anyway. So, here's the Su uh, Suzu. It's kind of, like, bulky, I gotta say. Um, otherwise, right, it's nice. It's like a bit, it's like the boombox, like really thick in the packaging. 
but it's a really nice model. I really like it. Okay, next one we got is the 1969 Chevrolet Camaro. It's open like really easily on like Monster Jams. Nice. I do have, I have a model of this somewhere. Um, here it is. It's like a bronze gold casting. Really nice. Like it. Uh. Okay. Um, windshield is a bit wobbly, but that's okay. Yeah, black interior. No headlights painted on. That really get, gets me when they don't paint the headlights on it, but I don't know. It's going to make do with it. I don't think... Oh, yeah, they did paint the... They painted the headlights on the Cisco, but... Okay. Um, next up, Chevy Citation, Johnny Lightning. Um, I believe there are chase pieces for Johnny Lightning. They have white wheels. I'm going to be really careful with it because it's definitely a better better made car. Metal on metal. Nice. Don't know being good. Anyway. Okay, nice car. Here it is. Bit smaller than other cars. Compare this, yeah, definitely smaller than other cars. Um, but you know, it's a it's a different uh, company that makes them. Ooh, bit wobbly, but it's not like bad. Like, if you guys ever get green lights, you have like a really high chance that the wheel will be like bent up. Or some every time I get a green light, the wheels are like jammed into the the wheel sockets, and they don't ride smoothly. And then people on Instagram get them and they ride fine. It's not really your x but that's why I don't get green lights. And they're, like, really, like, they're, like, $12, so. But, yeah, guys, um, that was my vacation haul. Uh, hope you enjoyed. Be sure to see, um, obviously more videos coming up. This is on series sign-ups. Not sure when they're gonna be, but, yeah. Um, thank you all for watching. Thank you for 96 subscribers as of now. Um, don't know if I'll... Don't know if, what it's at by the time I record this, but please get us to 100. Or just me to 100, because, uh, yeah. But thank you all for watching, and be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. See ya.